Arsenal fan TV right at the airport at the moment. You know what? I'm getting a bit worried about this flight. It's very foggy out there at the moment. Um, so hoping, I mean, there's already a bit of like a 20 minute delay. They're saying on it, but I'm hoping they ain't gonna be too bad and we get off on time. Um, on our way, of course, to Belgrade. I'm looking forward to this one. Arsenal versus Red Star Belgrade. As I was coming through a minute ago through the immigration, there was a Tottenham fan who works there and he was just giving it. Oh, where are you going, Belgrade? We were at the Burnabout. It is what it is. This is where we are. It's the Europa League. And look who else is here. Right. <laughs> and he's actually here on time. He's taken a sensible move this time. Yeah. Instead of going via about six different countries, yeah. he's decided to come with us. We're going yeah. sports options one way straight into Belgrade and then after the game straight out. Yeah. Easy, simple. Simple, isn't it? If you'd, if you'd have hooked me up last time, I would have been all right. We did I? hook you up last time. No. You just didn't want to come. You no, thought no, no, that no. you'd go on about. I'm trip, not having that. You I'm know? not having that. I'm not, I'm not having it. I'm not having it. But yeah, that's the only thing that worries me is that fog. It's, it is foggy, isn't it? It looks, yeah. Well, hopefully, hopefully it clears. Hopefully we get over there and you know, hopefully we can bring the three points back. So. What do you, we? What do you? Any do you predictions know what, do you, or anything? What do, do you, you know what, Robbie? Is? I'm enjoying the Europa League at the moment. Yeah. Because it's a break from the Premier League. The Europa League team, the players that are playing, seem to be, you know, enjoying it and playing well. Mm. So we're seeing a bit of decent football, um, and I'm enjoying visiting new countries. And you get to see Jack <laughs> Wilshire play, right? You know what I mean? Which is something go. something you don't normally get to see in the Premier League, which is what we all would love to see. And Rhys Nelson. Uh, and Rhys Nelson. Predictions yeah. for tonight. Um, I think that we need to score within the first 20 minutes to quieten the fans. A bit like I, how we did yeah, over in, in I, Belarus. I think it? if we do that, then the game can open up. So, but the longer it stays nil-nil, um, the longer they'll you know they'll feel mm. a little, quite confident. So, but I'm. Um, yeah, I'll go for a free-one win. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to go for free-one as well. I know, you know, there's a lot of things being about the hostile stadium and stuff like that, but it is one of them ones with a running track around it. And to be fair, you know what? These players now should be used to hostility. And as I said, I think uh, Jack Walsh being in the team, for me, that's a real plus. That really makes the game... Would you make him captain? I would make him captain, yeah. It's time to make this guy captain. Although, when I think about it, he's another guy that's decided a new deal yet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, but I would make him the captain. Probably be Murtasaka. I think Murtasaka probably. Play I don't think Murtasaka's play, uh, travelled. Oh, he's travelled. I've heard that the young lad, the Silvers, going centre back with Dabuchi. Dabuchi's definitely starting because Wenger said yesterday he is. Well, you know, we didn't. Um, and Aspina's not travelled. Right. Let's revise that free one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've just revised that to a one-one. <laughs> All right. But uh, looking forward to the game. We're gonna do this.